welcome everybody to another episode of the Gangster Chronicles. I'm one of the hosts, Norman Steele. And Big James. And today we got some special guests. Um, two of the guys, newest cats on Digital Soapbox right now from On The Line Podcast. Y'all want to introduce yourself? I'm Junior. I'm JJ Fompy. Yeah, On The Line Podcast, they talk about any and everything that goes down in the penile system. Y'all want to explain y'all show a little bit? So when they do catch up with it? So, in the line, on the line, we have several different segments of the show. Tell me what. Uh, can you hear me? So, uh, one of the segments is called High Speed Chase. Second segment is called um, uh, Law Library. Another segment is called uh, uh, Part of the Game. Next one is called, another segment is called Chop It Up. So, uh, those are the segments of the show, and those are the topics we uh, the current events we will elaborate it, uh, elaborate on in our show. If you check out our show on the line with Junior and JJ Fumble on Digital Soul Bar Network. All right. Hit that like and hit the subscription button. Even on Gangster Comics, go hit that like, hit the subscription button. If you need the comments. All right. Well, let's go. These are two homeboys that's been in that and locked up for most of their life. So now they got a show and go put y'all up on game. James, what's going on with you, my brother? Oh, man, everything, everything. <laughs> Trying to stay focused and do my thing. Yeah. I, 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 I want to touch on, and and I don't watch YouTube like that and all this other shit, but when people start hitting me, I had to check it out. This little Takashi cat, I, I just want to touch on this dude mm. because I think he truly got life f***ed up in a, in a very big misunderstanding of, of what he did. You can't glorify that situation. I don't give a f if you try to glorify it with a hammer, uh, rape, uh, murder, robbery, none of that. Shit. You know, to do what you did and then send people to prison and then come home and then say the reasons why he did it is is sad. You you did what you did because they was your baby mama youngster the first thing you do is was your baby mama raped by any one of them cats no she wasn't raped she gave them the so they was doing something and putting it down a way you couldn't <laughs> and she gave up the oh, boy. you were sitting out there and, and you knew what you was getting yourself involved in hanging out kicking it uh this, this, to me, this is what happened. I need to build not only my self-esteem, but I need, uh, I need to build up my, my gangsterism. The only way I can do that is go with some real. Nuts. When he did that, now I, I have this behind me. It's, it's not like a contract you could tear up and just move on. <laughs> Now you you stuck and you don't have a way out, so your only way out is to get caught up in the situation, and that's the video on why they doing dirt and all this other bullshit. So you pretty much set yourself up just like you did them, but there's no excuse for the way this dude is talking. There's no excuse for it. He's talking like I was justified in what I, you know, getting at these cats like that. No, you're not justified. Uh, why did they whoop your ass? You ain't told that story. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Why, why did the mother? Why would I put my hands on this cat? Because if if you up under my under my tutelage, mm -hmm. and and I'm getting paid the way you say you was paying, mm -hmm. nobody in the hood gonna touch you. I'm going to prison. Or I'm gonna get killed by the homies <laughs> because you. With my money, right, right. and and that's what them dudes was doing, man. They was taking care of that cat. They mm. gave him what he wanted, mm. and there's a lot of cats in the music business that don't don't fall up under that 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 creed. They you know come up grown and born straight gangsters, mm -hmm. gangsters by nature and not by choice. Mm -hmm. You know some of these cats are just pulled in. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And then now that they 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 where they want to be mm. now is you you try to slide out get the fuck out the way it don't work like that you done created a bomb motherfucker. you don't understand and just because you paid your money spending money taking care of motherfucker, you're not excluded from the rules 
Exactly. This hood. Well, sure, well, you know sure. what the biggest thing is that though with him, he pretty much used them motherfuckers to get the notoriety that he wanted in the hood. He that talked was the cash. Word I was get. He used them to get notoriety, talk cash to everybody, and really he was running New York. Didn't nobody say nothing back to him because they wasn't scared of him. They were scared of the people he was running with. And a couple of them cats, his glasses on, boy, Mount Dew glasses, mm-hmm. he messed with male murder and all of them dudes, right? So the thing was, he used them to get his notoriety. He saw the heat was coming down. He got tired of paying. So he said, you know what? I'm about to drop the dime. Once the heat came down, it was an escape plan for him because he knew that what was going to happen was exactly going to happen. We live in the generation of suckers right now. <laughs> <laughs> that accept any and every damn thing. Well, 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 I'm not just gonna leave it on Takashi though. On on that note, because it's 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 our fault that we allow any and everything to come in the hood. But yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's like we allow so much bullshit right now, man. It's like the dude came back, man. He just broke the internet record with thirty something million views. Mm-hmm. It is like you know, back in our time with nobody, and I don't want to sound like one of them old. But it's the truth. I know they get sick of hearing us talking and everything, but that's why we got formats like this, just to keep it all the way funky. This dude should have been got his head busted open, man. (laughs) Well, the rules are uh, uh, changed, has changed big time. Uh, You know, this situation, you don't have to sit on the couch and wait for paperwork. You know, Mm. you saw this dude do this. You know what I'm saying? Back in the days, that's the only time a mother would move on you is when that cat sun that paperwork home. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And it's, it's black and white. It's there. You you already out of here. You know what I'm saying? Now, you know, it's, it's fucked up because you got, you got cats that use the word snitch very, very loosely. You know what I'm saying? And, and now you have... Falling in line just because another said woo the wham bam. It ain't sitting back and show me the paperwork. You know what I'm saying? This cat on on a note like that, anytime you stand over there and they said, Is is Michael Jackson present? Do you see the man that robbed you? And you say, Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's you, you, you already done. That's next year. Uh, you that's done that. at that point. Uh, that's next year. The official like a referee blowing the whistle. Right. So how can you come home and 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 got all these excuses? If they tried to kill you, they would have killed you. Half of the excuses that you use. And then at, at first I was sitting back like, man, he kind of like make a point. But you have other options. You the motherfucker with the money. You could have said, I'll be back and don't come back. You all, He should have had a spot where he could go mm. to 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 be out of sight, out of mind, and then had to fuck with them dudes no more. And that's just called just leaving them dry. Mm-hmm. Now y'all ain't got the mother money no more, but I'm out of here. And then go on and do your thing. Mm. This is the reasons why I left. But you can't use that excuse because you left funky. You feel me? Yeah, that- his exit was all bad. Yeah, and it, and it, <laughs> and it just fucked up how, it, how he, he he's out there the dude, the little cat is just so arrogant, you know what I'm saying? And and out there showing his little money and his jewelry and shit like that. Well, you just you just named the main thing. He the dude with the bag, right? Yeah. When you got the bag, that means you have power. Yeah. That means that you go get some n- tougher than them n- that you fooling with, and you bring them on the squad now. Right. But he was but just don't a, let him in that deep. You know what I mean? He. Go, I don't mean to cut you off, but. This dude, what, 24, 25 years old, this little cat don't know the game like that. For sure, for you sure. You know what I'm saying? Well, definitely. His intro was f***ed up. The only reason why he got in is because he had the money. The only reason why he wanted out is because he was losing his money. He was giving his money to n****s that he was knowing f***ing his girl. You know what I'm saying? Mm. So, you know, don't blame it on them, but you still want to be with baby mama? Now, baby mama was giving the f- away. It didn't matter about the money, because nope. no. she was getting down in a real kind of way. Yeah, yeah, yeah it was. It was. Uh, I'm that, just, talk, talk that, that just let him know what she did. She thought you was a clown from the beginning. <laughs> exactly. From the, from the jump, she already knew you was a buster. 
Woo wee, here we go. Any, any real it goes bro, live now. Any real bro know. Speak okay, on it. Your homeboy trying to get at That's what Pillow Talk come in. Hey, babe, you know so and so ain't no good. What do you do? Oh, he tried to slide up on me, but you going to handle that a different way. She never did none of that. Because that wouldn't. That, she, that, look, 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 she just took the. Yeah. Continuously. <laughs> Continue. It's one time, all right, but you doing this repetitively, that makes you a repeat offender. I'm yeah. wrong with it, dog. But it's just a conversation that, right. that, that these brothers have. That gang mentality is a mother. Yeah. And yeah. they draw you in. Yeah, you got, you got to think like that. That's, what pillow, that. Talk. That's what pillow talk is. Yeah. She was real. She didn't do and, that, and though. She never. See, women can see a, a mark, a bust, or whatever oh, you want to call it. Oh, man, most definitely. Just as we can mm -hmm. see it. Mm -hmm. You just a mm -hmm. with money. That's exactly. all, but I got something for you. I'm going to slide up under you, and then I got some real niggas who going to come get that from you. Which yeah. That happened many a times, and that's what yeah. happened with him. You know what I'm saying? She seen him as a from the beginning, but he got the money. Can I say something? <clears throat> uh, this is uh, this is this is what we call real talk right here. Um, we kind of, um, uh, not me, and I learned from my experience, but people now today oppose too much on these entertainers. He's an entertainer, correct? Yeah. Right, right. So he's really not a real live street. He's a he's a pretendo or a wannabe, and then and he had the bread or had access to bread right. to pay some real. I gotta be careful how I tread this. No, you don't. I don't. No, okay. Hell no. Okay. All right. <laughs> So, it's like, dude, I <coughs> see you. Right. <laughs> You're not hiding, bro. Right. So, there's a segment we got on, on the line show called, what's the segment called? Part of the game. Part of the game. Part of the he game. wasn't, he, he didn't listen to his older homies or any homie to learn, let him know that these things can happen in the course of you out here about that life. Really about that life, not for real, but for play. So he got a part of something and realized this shit get real when he's talking to those federal officers and he's incarcerated, he's standing for count, eating that burrito, that peanut butter and apple, standing up in the cold ass cell, he ain't got no cell phone. You know what I mean? It's it's not about this individual we're talking about. It's about let's let's keep it real. He's just a person that had a platform that can speak on it, like we had a platform to speak about his ignorance and his demise. Right. Okay, so um, there's other people that's from all around the world and around the United States that got to understand this. Don't hate the game, hate the player. Meaning this, he wanted to portray that he was a real street He wanted to be out there flossing, throwing up, whatever, whatever turf he threw up. I don't know the particular name of the turf. He threw the turf up. But he he wouldn't really won. He really wouldn't won. No, well they they get that they get that they get the picture now. Okay, yeah, now. But yeah, but I mean, he, it's not even it's not even being it's not even. I mean, let's just. But just he really wouldn't with the shit like that. It's not. It's, it's time to get he didn't have to shit. be, and they knew that from the beginning right, when they. Right. Well, those around him knew he really would, but in his mind, he thought he was with the shit, but he really wasn't with the shit. No, he didn't. He didn't think that. No. He had a he had a game plan going in. At twenty four, he had a, a twenty four. Yeah, game plan. what else you do? You have seen it done by many by 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 so many others in the industry. They they hire gang members, they hire bodyguards, they hire my, and then now I can act out and be a certain kind of way. Mm -hmm. Now now I, the first time I seen this little cat was at the L A airport, and he had a fight with some 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 random dudes. dudes. Yeah, so. He was on, I don't know, trying to prove himself to, mm. to the homies or or his security mm. slash homeboys, right. which turned out he he got himself caught up in the game because he wasn't bred there. He wouldn't, it wouldn't, this wasn't his lifestyle. That's what I was getting to. Okay, so he chose to pay for that lifestyle. Now, by the, by the time that he got in it and he saw it, it was thick. It was real. It was no other way out of that. No other way out of that. <laughs> because they, the, they was in him. The Piper. Yeah, they was in him. <laughs> they was in his pockets deep. They was in his girl deep. <laughs> they was in his life. And he couldn't get them out of his life. So it just goes back to show where how because you got money, 
you 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 put yourself in situations. I've seen it. I you know you. what I'm saying? Well, you know what, James? Actually, Takashi is not the first person to do this. No. He's just the first person to be in the public eye because I don't. I'm not gonna go into too many details. But the situation that you was in, dude, kind of did the same thing. Suge did the same. Suge, well, what Suge did was he incorporated the homies, the hood, and the hood got him to that level. Once he got on that level, he figured he can be that dog and shake the fleas, but you couldn't shake the fleas because now you, 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 you. He consumed the hood now. He, he all hood now, mm. and and. Some people can't take power and, 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 and be good with it and know how to use it. The authority is a mother being able to do shit that you couldn't do in high school, hmm. touch a mother right. and, and walk away from it. You couldn't do that in high school. Well, school but now you can beat ass and, and, and choke people and do all these different things because you got those cats behind you. But well, see, here's the, here, here's the thing that separates... That's the same scenario, but here's the thing that separates Suge from this clown. Oh, I would never put Suge in. Oh, no, not Nowhere no. near that. No, Suge is nothing like that. all the game. He knew them before he was Suge. So it's no, it's no problem to go back and get the homies. These dudes, he just probably met over a cup of tea or something. Well, Suge grew up in the hood. That he did. But the catch that he had on his payroll, he did not know. Right. Suge, and I knew Suge, but my brother didn't know Suge. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? My brother Bunchy didn't know Suge. Now, Shug. let me ask you this. When Takashi 6 9 came in, this intro was all f***ed up from the beginning. Test my gangster, suck my dick. You just wilding out. <laughs> but he can talk like that because he already incorporated these cats, mm -hmm. these hitters, these that's with the right. business. But the thing about that is, the number one thing, you disrespecting people, bro. You can't be doing that shit. That's what I'm paying y'all for. Because if they come at me, y'all going to take care right. of them. Right, but at the same time, they probably feel like this dude running his mouth too much and he getting this in some that we ain't if, from, so, But you know, see, that would have saved them a court case if, if they'd have thought like that. I'd have exactly. been left that little right, alone. <laughs> nigga, right, you, you, right. you, you dynamite. I'd have been walking away. They've had a couple of hot ones. He was going to different was. states and getting into it with everybody. Like, I see I'm here. Because he can now. Out, he because he shit. can now. But the nigga from L.A. got in his ass. But when see, the All -Star game now he's dealing with a different breed of gangster. Right. Well, now, you know, and he was um he had beef with a dude from that I heard is a real cat. They say the Casanova cat is a real cat, right? The Casanova dude out of New York. Yeah. You know, Takashi and them, I guess, busted on dude, right? Dude didn't retaliate like he was running with some official dudes out there in New York. Wasn't nobody scared of Takashi, but see, Takashi, what happened is he tore his ass all around the country. It's not like he could be like the mother New York to move out here to California, up around right. here where we at exactly. somewhere. He couldn't go because he don't got, in the course of him running around talking shit to everybody, he don't got himself with some shit with some real cats out here that was trying to really get to him. Mm -hmm. But they could never get to him like they wanted to. So it's like he in a no win situation. He can't go to Atlanta because he got it the into it with down there. He into it with. I hear, where are you gonna move to Mars? Because right. everybody in the country, he don't start so much shit around the country that he can't go nowhere. Because if he'd have came out here, he'd have got tore up. That's why I say his intro into the game was all that he just came in disrespectful. Exactly. And I'm not trying to say nobody else, nowhere else is soft, but LA cats handle their business a little bit more different. You can't talk crazy like that out here and get away with it. That's what that's what down south, that's what all of those guys that's not from California are totally different from like our gang banging is 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 on a different level than the rest of those cats. Mm. New York them don't really like ain't on the real bloods and crip thing. So the level of gang banging is is totally different. Mm -hmm. My mentality is totally different from some of the cats in New York. That don't mean you ain't got them on that type of tip. Yeah, that we are saying New York people soft, so I don't want to hear no sh in the comments, are y'all seeing New York stuff? No, we're not saying that. It's just a different level. Oh, yeah, out I, I, I've been there. I got some homies over there, and they push, they push the line all over there. All over. Oh, yeah. Uh, vice versa. But uh, kind of uh, uh, tripping off something, man. I, I am. Not y'all, maybe so, maybe he is. But we got to understand, we just keep using this, this gentleman's name, right? 
that problem has this in our own community today. Not at the magnitude, but not and someone who has a platform as such as he had at the time. Oh, well, we had that, problem. yeah, we oh, had that, that stuff had to happen in, our, in his time and your time and in my time as well. You just keeping it 100, snitching the hills, you know, telling the hills at an we, all time high. We, 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 we're saying cooperate with the authorities. Oh, cooperate. Well, you know what it comes <laughs> down to, man. Not saying that is not the way you should deal with things, but if you're a, a gang member, an active gang member, you should not be cooperating with the authorities. I, I active gang member, and I'm here to tell you, brother, just because you're an active gang member don't mean you are not subject to uh, be friendly with the police. It's called everybody and the majority of all the guys out there, they got tickets. They use them when they feel it's necessary. The California is giving up too much time for a month. When they say, what are you finna do, 55 years? Man, check this out. Hold up, <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Let's pray about this. And, 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 and this is and this is what we gotta understand because man, the police don't have no say in the court. No. But what you no, say no. sitting at that table talking to detectives and other shit like that, VA. that's what they take in the court and use against you. What's that? You know what I'm saying? Now I I pretty much think it's fed up because if you know this it killed nine people and I killed four, why you wanna convict me? That's because I'm ruthless. You don't think he is so you're going to use him mm -hmm. to get me. Mm -hmm. We'll give you five years. Mm -hmm. He going to jump on the five years mm -hmm. to say that I'm the beast. Mm -hmm. you, you this, you that. Yeah. But we both kill us. Secretary speaking. Yeah, but we both kill us. Mm -hmm. So let him, I mean, it's, the, the system is, is totally fucked up. Hold on, but the, 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 let me say, design has been there from the beginning of time. Mm -hmm. And it kills me to hear some. And I know everybody that watched this show got a motherfucker to say, oh, yeah, man, I ain't, man, there's been so many goddamn um, huggy bears and, <laughs> um, I mean, just guys that, that got relationship with the police. You know what I'm saying? Met, some of them met him from the county jail. Mm. When, the, when the gang mobs was 48 and 4300. You're talking about Operation Safe, Opera, Operation Safe Jail and, uh, OSS Operation yeah. Safe Street. It's, it's, they just Department. have a program, and they 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 know how to shake us up. They know how to get you to talk without even talking. And the next thing you do, he gonna go to the next door mm -hmm. and say, "Well, your boy just told us what happened, mm -hmm. and he told me you was the gunner. Mm -hmm. What the fuck you think he finna do? Oh, he a motherfucker lie. He ain't finna pin this on me. That <laughs> had the motherfucker gun. It was a black nine, and he had on." That's that's how it go, but it's, it shouldn't go that way. It, it, it should not go it that shouldn't. way. But, but it, you, it has happened. But it will continue if, to happen. If, if some you people. got you got cats that get out of jail mm -hmm. after doing this, the the it's it's done changed. Yeah. Because they ain't getting killed for it. If you're bored in the house, bored in the house, bored. Why not play with your balls? Our sponsor today, Manscaped, is here to make sure your balls are smooth while you or your partner are playing with them. Manscaped promotes clean hygiene when it comes to shaving your balls thanks to their lawnmower 3.0. Manscaped is the only men's brand dedicated to below-the-waist grooming. While you are probably looking for new things to do at home, why not make Manscaping part of your routine? You know what's funny? When James got his Manscaped in the mail, he called me and said, Man, I feel like a new man. My balls feel so fresh and so clean. And I said, James, the last thing I want to do is hear about your balls, man. Come on. Manscaped is forever changing the grooming game with their Perfect Package 3.0. Precision engineered tools for your family jewels. The Perfect Package 3.0 kit comes with the new and improved Lawnmower 3.0 waterproof cordless body trimmer and a ton of other liquid formulations to round out your manscaping routine. This third-generation trimmer features a cutting-edge ceramic blade to prevent manscaped accidents. Oh, man, just imagine getting cut on your balls. Millions of balls are about to be nick-free thanks to Manscaped's advanced skin-safe technology. Inside the perfect package, you'll also find the Manscaped Crop Preserver, an anti-chafing ball deodorant and moisturizer. No more smelly balls. You're probably sitting on the couch with your hand on your balls anyway. You might as well keep them smooth as eggs and smell them fresh. Subscribe to the perfect package to get a replacement new blade refill for your lawnmower trimmer delivered to your door every three months, making sure your trimmer always stays fresh and clean. Now, for a limited time, subscribers get not one but two free gifts. 
The Shed Travel Bag with $39 value and a patented high-performance anti-chafing Manscaped Boxer Briefs. This is the perfect package for your perfect package. Get 20% off plus free shipping with the code TGC101 at manscaped.com. Do yourself a favor and always use the right tools for the job. Get 20% off and free shipping with the code TGC101 at manscaped.com. That's 20% off with free shipping at manscaped.com and use code TGC101. Make playing with your balls the best part of your day. Thanks, Manscaped. Again, that's use the code TGC101 at manscaped.com. That's M-A-N-S-C-A-P-E-D.com. There's no reason for you to be walking around with smelly, musty balls. Get yourself together, man. James did it. Mm-hmm. What the, you know, that's what I'm saying, man. You exactly right. I'm going to tell you another dude, man, who ain't nobody. And Reggie said this. And this ain't me. You know how we feel about the just pointing brothers out and stuff. Well, it's not. But, no, I got to speak on this. What, what's his name? The cat, Jim Jones. The rapper? Yeah, Jim Jones. Mm-hmm. Now, you think about this. You know, he don't duck all kind of jail time, gun cases and drug cases, you know. And it's like the thing is, this man, had he was facing five felony counts and a misdemeanor from his June 2018 arrest. He was sentenced to two years probation and a $1,500 fine. Three of the six charges were dropped. He was running the run. No, no, but hold on. Let me finish right now. Felony counts, possession of a firearm, all kind of stuff, man. This dude don't got away with all kind of stuff and ain't got near a bit of jail time. Maybe he had a and you know, lawyer. And no, but they said he was running around with them cats too. I think he's mixed up in this thing too, man. Okay. If he is, Alleg- let, it, him, it is. let him allegedly. Get caught. Allegedly, yeah. let him get caught. Don't tell on me. It's not if I get caught, we get caught. If that is not how it works. It's plain and simple, man. If Jim Jones was in the middle of that, he'd be in jail right now. Takashi wouldn't have wasted five minutes to put him in it and say this motherfucker did woo woo too. You know what I'm saying? And 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 this is the cold thing, man. I'm not going to just start throwing monkeys in the bucket no. because this is said, fuck it. I'm not going to throw him in this situation and my f- up get down because if he got away, he got away. Right. If right. he out of the situation, let him stay out of it. Mm, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Mm. But but that little cat didn't do that. That little cat got the name of the girl. What's her name? Cardi B. Cardi B and oh, everybody else. Oh, <laughs> Cardi B auntie. Cardi B grandmama. <laughs> Cardi B's <laughs> granddaddy was dead 30 years ago. <laughs> he told him the mother that was in World War II. Hey, look, man. Yeah. This is rough. Fuck that. I mean, for the, for, the, for the homies that are incarcerated in the state and the feds right now that probably was a victim of somebody ratting on them or cooperate with the authorities. Yeah, dog, man, that's, that's bad out here on the streets. I just want to address that, dog. And I'm saying that man up there, key ways of down moves are non affiliates. No matter who you are in there at this time. Well, that shit is way bad out here in the streets, man. And this motherfucker right here, this gentleman right here, he's a prime uh, poster kid for that type of shit. And then mess around, had these kids out here in these streets, believing that shit was cool for the dude. And I'm going to tell you right now, that's going to happen to one of these kids. Oh, these younger folks, the one of them will get they to get their noodles knocked out because they was like, "Well, Takashi, whatever his name is, said he did this, and I could do this." Right. Then y'all gonna have a cremation and a car wash for that mother. I'm just being real. I'm not. I don't want that to happen. But as time has has passed, and, and how they groupy and jump on stuff and look for stuff to attach themselves to, this is a demonstration right here. I don't know when it's gonna happen. I believe me, it's going to pop up in the news on the internet. It's going to show that somebody believed Takashi, whatever his name, it was but, right with what he did, and they're going to try to utilize it in their life. Right. And they're going to come up not breathing. But see, even and, after he then pointed his finger, told him whatever, okay, I told, let me get out, lay low, get back to business. He partying like he just. I mean, you you know. Because ain't nobody yeah. going to do nothing. He got the feds all around him. Who going to go, like, really at this time? Who is going to go yeah. do something to him right now? The police is all around this dude. All he Exactly. Got, he got the whole entire precinct probably in his backyard. He got the United States with him. Yeah, who going to go do something <laughs> to him? But, well, he going to have to some, fall in line. Yeah, but at some time, they don't protect you forever. It's going to be a point in time where they going to feel like, okay, losing the range on him. And you, you, because 
one, you acting a fool. It's like, why are you doing this? Now we got to relocate you to somewhere else. Or... Yeah, he don't, got, he don't have to get relocated twice already from what well, I understand. Want, exactly. yeah, so after a while, they're going to just be like, you know what? You you gotta, don't. Yeah, you got to look at it. He don't have a face that you can hide. No, he doesn't. Ah. Uh, he would have to go through the laser tags. <laughs> he would have to do all kinds of to not be recognized. No, serious. He got too many tattoos. He would have to wear makeup <laughs> every morning. Hey. Uh, that's, that's so he ain't hiding. No. Can, can I say something? Yeah, you know, go man? ahead. Listen, this is a youngster. He ain't lived that long. I know we, you know, blah, 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 blah. He's a youngster, man, and he don't really know the significance of, of the shit that he really done to himself. Oh, he know, man. He you think know. he do? Yeah, you hell think he yeah, do? You know. He ain't lived that Let long, but he what? lived long enough. Let me ask you this question. 24 years, man. You got some cats out there that lived a lifetime at seven and nine years old that been there for him to get where he was at and to get involved with some real gangsters he ain't stupid but i'm talking about severity what i mean by that let me get to what i'm <clears throat> making i'm trying to make it real fast he haven't walked off 10 years or five years on him in a federal prison he still think it's a game yeah right so when i first went to prison i didn't give a fuck about going to the yard my older homies look like this, you know, I can't say all the stuff they said, but it's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I went to the yard, did my, with a couple years, I did, well, I think, four years on the yard. I was back out in the street with the shit. Soon as they let me out, my first time, right? Didn't give a about what they was talking about, who was talking it. I'm trying to do this, this is what I'm doing. I'm banging, and I'm, I'm hitting legs. Right, right. right. I got my ass caught up and got sent back to the yard. So what I'm saying to him, this is the first time publicly that we know of. I don't even know the guy. I'm just going on this conversation. He went to federal prison. That's, you know, whatever, a couple months, whatever, dry out, whatever it is. So now he back out. And he think, oh, that wasn't shit. I got, I got a paid lawyer. I got, I got out. I'll be able to get out of emotion by getting emotion. So he haven't really walked off no, no decade or half of a decade. I don't believe he ever will because... And realize, At the end of the day, somebody is gonna run into him when when the when the when the smoke cleared and all that shit wear off. Mm -hmm. He gonna find himself by himself mm -hmm. and on his like, own. Like, like Steele mm -hmm. said, he created all these problems in different states and on the coast. Now he created another problem because you didn't tell on one person; you told on a few. Now they have homies and they have friends. It's like, look, you know what I um, mean? The thing is, he told on some people that got paper too, man. So they ain't got to ever lift a finger. Right. You know, if I'm if I'm worth a couple million dollars, if I'm worth one million dollars, I'm not gonna ever lift my finger to go do nothing. But I'm I, I, I'm not gonna I'm not I'm not gonna give this that kind of credit that he that smart. I'm not. I no, not, not him. You know no, what? No, no, I'm not no, gonna give no, him credit. I'm gonna tell y'all something. I, I'm saying what you saying that the people that he told on they got bread. I'm gonna tell y'all something. I understand no. where you come from. I, com yeah. I completely understand where you coming from. I'm just saying I'm not gonna get this. Kind of credit no, I'm, I'm at 24 a, years yeah, old, but I'm gonna tell y'all, no no, rocket science, he ain't no, he ain't no I'm smart tell y'all something about this all. kid. And we, might he was, he was put in a situation where he had to, he listened to the, the federal, the he cooperated with the authorities and they dictated this program. Yeah, you that's know what, what happened with him. I'm gonna tell you and that happens with a lot of the people that get in the same situation he has been in, in now. Uh, no, they, let me tell you something, not they didn't just, they didn't just find Takashi 69. They didn't just find him and call him and say, man, we need you to uh, give up your boys. <laughs> they didn't just find him. <laughs> okay, okay. If, 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 if it, it make more sense of him calling them and say, man, I got some motherfuckers on my heels. I can't get them off my <laughs> Real. And they <laughs> involved in <laughs> Right. The it's, same it's, stuff he's saying. In. That's what I'm saying. This motherfucker ain't as stupid as you want to no, make he ain't. thing. He's Hell a no. very calculating. This stuff is just yeah. not no accident. He plotted this whole thing. You could tell from the beginning, the man went to the breakfast club the day that all this stuff cracked down and pretty much said something was about to go down. Well, I'm separating myself from them because, right. you know, they're not good people. I want to separate myself. He it's time for me to change my life. He didn't been knew what was going down. He had to do I wouldn't that. be surprised if this had a plan from the gate. I'm going to get in with them, and when he saw it got too thick, say, man, you know what? I'm going to tell on them. I'm going to tell. He probably knew that. <laughs> yeah, I'm not going to rule it out. But I believe that he was the law. The, the, the authorities had laced him how to run the play. And then I gotta go. I don't back. think he that damn smart. But then the thing is, okay, wait a minute. Hold up, no. Let me let me let me answer this. So you don't think he that smart 
even if the, even if the feds came at him and said, we need you to set these cats up. How the f*** did he get away with doing that? He just cool, calm, and collective the whole time. He ain't he ain't it put them up that. on nothing. He ain't he ain't he ain't nervous. He ain't doing shit. This dude is taking videos from the car while they robbing mother. This dude is doing videos, and the video ain't doing this. The you little mother it. knew what he doing was doing, and he he done it before. He been there. I said I wouldn't rule it out, but I, my prediction, I'm not going to rule out what you're saying. Yeah. What he's still saying, or Junior's saying, I'm saying that I'm not going to give him that credit. Right. That means you can give him that credit. He can give him credit. You can give him credit. Definitely I'm saying, me plan. personally. Right, right. But I believe he was coached. I think he's a plan. I, I, I really oh, no, do he, think no, no, I, no, I think he's a plan. It's not that he used to call it a mole. He's literally said, hey, I cooperate with the authority, the federal government, the United States, to, to prosecute these I claim they used to be my homeboys. And boys. you know what? You know so, what? Yeah, and money, I mean, I'm not arguing that, that issue. The money that he been flashing or doing, that probably came from them. Some show money. It could be. It's, it's, well, it's, it's all kind of avenues to the this way shit, This shit is deeper than what the eyes can see. It's well, deeper than the mother. It's deeper than, because it should be right in front of us mm. as black people, as whatever gang members or whatever it's right in our face mm. the games the police play with us the mm -hmm. the way the police play us against mm -hmm. each other yeah. the way the police keep me mad at you because if we mad at each other we ain't gonna get together exactly. we ain't gonna come together so if they keep us separated separated then they can they can Work divide and conquer it's yeah. the same thing yeah, circle theory. so even with the with takashi yeah. he could be okay man we've been trying to get these motherfuckers. we know they murderers we trying to get them, mind you, they don't give a fuck about us, but they just want to do their job and they keep their job. So we're going we gonna to need you to be one to one bound. Mm -hmm. But in his case, he grew up. That motherfuckers know him as a kid working in the store the whole right, nine. Right. So no, I he got involved in something that got a little too heavy for him. Correct. And I his only yeah. way out was to call the police and say, <laughs> I'm telling you, man, <laughs> I don't see that little boy doing nothing else. The little, he, he, he was scared for his life now at this point because they, they slapped the shit out of him. Everything else. Yeah. I, I, I'm not saying he wasn't. You know what, though, I, man? I, I'm going to tell you all this. Real for and, and this is the truth right here. We can sit up here and talk about this little rat till we blew in the face. No, we what? done. We done. He going to go out there and steal, sell a, a gazillion records. People don't give a damn no more. I don't know. I want. I, I, I'm not. See, you know, I've been different, and my mama know I'm different. It is because you, you know, I, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna say this. I want to see what he do. If he sell the Americans like you think he would, I don't think he would. I don't think he. I don't think the oh, concert. He, he the already concert, doing it, man. The man just broke the internet. Man, that ain't nothing. He just broke the internet. The video don't got the video alone. What he, he put on there he, if he had the two form. hours. Then he put about man. I'm telling you, the video you, with the two girls. Yeah, if he did the form right now, if they said Takashi can do a concert at the form tomorrow, that mother would be sold out. How many I, people? I got. 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 Fat meat greasy. It don't matter. This gonna be a whole bunch of kids there. You agree? Kids. Use the word kids. That's what I'm saying, because they don't give a damn about all no, that they stuff. Don't. They, they, it's, it's not only that they don't give a damn, they really don't understand the ramifications. He's just, they don't understand snitching. What is that? Well, he told to get out of jail. Oh, okay, well, he didn't, you know, they was going to do this. No, too, well, so, you, you, you and, and you got people such as us that say, I would have did the same damn thing. You got people out there would have said, right. because they heard yeah. him say, but where was Who's my the justice? People, Who's the people? Who's the people? Are they non affiliates? Are they uh, affiliated members? A, everybody is associated by something. What's a non affiliate? A person that, that does not uh, actively be involved in gang. Oh well, gang banging it, stuff. If you know two, you 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 guilty by association. <laughs> <laughs> if you you guilty by association. <laughs> ain't no ain't a motherfucker that walk in the hood can say I don't know no gang bangers. I am not affiliated. My nephew's been going to jail and getting arrested by the police just because who their uncles was. You're guilty oh, yeah, that, by that, association. That happen. Yeah, that in you that case, me? what about the ones who don't? I'm talking about the ones who don't have an uncle, or a nephew, or a sister, brother, and cousin. Well, right, civilians that does get caught up. That's what I'm yeah. saying. Those who don't. Civilians are regular people. That's those are the ones I would address. But some people don't live by a code like correct. Do. They just correct. I just they want don't to go do my. Age, those are civilians. Those are not affiliated. And, not. And, and 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 live my life. Okay. Those are we were just talking about this, right? Mm -hmm. 
Now, what if a regular, a civilian, mm -hmm. get robbed? And that civilian go to court and say, yeah, that's the, them the guys that robbed me. That's mm -hmm. different. No, he's labeled as a snitch too. I'm tell, I'm that's true. I'm a, but, but, look, yeah. but why? I'm a civilian. You but, robbed me. I don't, I'm not but affiliated see, yeah, with you. This, this is where the shit is wobbly. The civilian, they look at him as a normal guy going to work. He get or robbed. Or a woman. Or a woman. He told on me. This is different because this cat came in, test my gangster. I can go anywhere I want. Yeah, it's I'm totally gonna, different. That, but Takashi is not a civilian. Right. So when you put your... He's a gang a, member. When you put... Or a gang wannabe. No, when he... You, when you well, put he was your, a member. They blessed him as certified. When you... They, he paid his way in there. But they blessed him as certified. Okay. They blessed him. How they blessed him, gave him a badge of honor or whatever. But when you tell on somebody as a civilian... It's normal, like, okay, well, he was just doing this normal thing. He was going to work. They robbed him. He got a family. So People look at it like that. He's not considered a snitch? No. Yeah. Fuck yeah, he is. Why? Because, because when you look when you look at Takashi, he's glorifying that life, running around, telling people to suck his just being totally But the postman is a is an average day man. Oh, the postman, he could tell him who, he, he's not... Bound by those rules right. or those No, standards. I use the word I use the word postman as as but, saying but civilian, instead of civilian. A, a regular guy. That okay. Has a nine to five. He's so not my grandmama him. is a rat because this man snatched her purse and got on, and then he came to the door selling selling hotcakes, no, and no, she no. called the police on him. No, so now she wait a minute. A now she go to now she go to court. Man, it, it, a man or woman? What's the difference between a rat? I mean. He's got to understand. If you tell, you tell. Listen to what you just said. But why the f did you I tell? You said your grandma. This is a lady who raised kids, probably raised everybody else's kids. She's not out there being disrespectful. I'm this, I'm that. Test my gangster. Nor is, she, a, nor is she, a civilian. She right. not, she's, not, she's not pressing. I think pressing y'all saying the same thing, James. I think he's saying the same thing you're saying. Mm. It's not the extras. Yeah, the, right, the, the, right. the extras that's I wanna, I wanna, I wanna get past Takashi because no, I think we so. gave that nigga a whole bunch of time. Yeah, real, but, real talk. And I and I think this this topic is is for all of us, and 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 how do we view each other opposed to watching every day being killed mm. by white boys, supremacists, whatever. The KKK, whatever the case mm -hmm. might be, this 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 young guy was jogging in his neighborhood, and these motherfuckers get out of the truck and and kill him. That was his neighborhood. Yeah, he lived in he lived that, in that community. That yeah, day in that community. Here's the thing about that: who gives a fuck if it wasn't his neighborhood? There's not a sign that says if you don't live here, you can't jog. No niggas can jog. If now, if it, now in some in in some neighborhoods, you got the gated community with HOAs and Melo. Hey, if you not if you don't live here, you can't be. But it's, 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 right. It's, but it's, if it's if it's no signs, he can draw where he want to draw. Exactly. Well, yeah, and the thing he with can him draw was, if he want to. What still, gives still, him the right to tell him this, that you can't up? jog here? So should he had stopped or kept jogging? Well, stop for what? There we go. What so, is, what and see, the thing for? was, they tried to say their whole reason for being was saying that there's been a rash of burglaries in the neighborhood. They saw him jog and he looked suspicious. So the dude get his gun, go tell his son they get their guns. They pretty much chased this dude down and gunned him down. Yep. And, That's and, what it was. Now, started him. Yeah. now, how the f do you, you say you got a man in some jogging shorts, a t shirt, and tennis shoes? He ain't got no burglary tools. Nothing in his hand. He just died because he's black. And he's he's jogging. Yeah, and what that's, they that's tried to say, you know, what the thing was, they said it's coming out now. Of course, they're trying to come out with some. They said he was looking. There was some houses under construction, and they said they saw him looking in the window, or whatever. How many times I've done that before? If I'm looking for some property, I might be looking for some property. If I see something new going up, I may go look. On some peekaboo. Check How many out. of us have done that? If you right. see a house or something that's you know go probably be for sale or something like that, and you go in and look at, that's how I bought my townhouse. You know, I was walking down Looking the street the and saw the sale that's sign, that's and I looked, I said, oh, that's nice right there. I like that right there. I'm going to come back and, you know, call the number on me. But there. that still don't constitute you murdering someone. That's what I'm saying. I, yeah, not just at all. Because, you know, if I may I speak, even though that using that, that, that's how you get lost in the sauce when you start addressing that issue. We're not even tripping that. We shouldn't even discuss that. We can discuss the issue that the man was unarmed, right? and you slaughtered him. 
in the story. Then they try and there's no justification about what he did prior to, to that. Self-defense. But how is it self-defense when you chase me down? Y'all got guns, I don't. Yeah. You defending yourself from what? An unarmed man? All right, let me ask you this, big dog. Just say in the hood. We in the hood kicking it. And a white boy come jogging past us. We going to stop that white boy and we kill him. Who's going to go to jail? And how much time do you think we're going to get for killing that white boy just because you're jail? We're going to bring the jail. Everybody, everybody, jail. everybody going, going to jail and we're going to death row. Right. So let's just switch <laughs> switch it around. Out here. And here we fun. go. Here we got a little boy with a hoodie on. And, and, and he in the apartments, he ain't doing shit, but a security guard can kill you. Come on. But if that's us killing the security guards that y'all got in our motherfucking complex, so-called they self protecting our shit. Mm-hmm. Yeah. What the? Fuck? What's? Yeah, I mean, yeah. you're right. If the shoe was on the other foot, man, it, this wouldn't be. They gonna nip that shit in the bud. What? They gonna make sure they find. They gonna take everybody in the hood to jail, cause they know somebody gonna say something. Right. And when that motherfucker say on. something, we all going to jail. We all gonna get life in prison. Mm-hmm. That. Might get capital murder. No, that's for sure. Dribble. Dribble. So out here. But but this ain't what and, and and this is where we fall off at, because we all should bear arms, and oh, and sure. and if if the shit happen, like because it's the shit is real. It's some racist motherfuckers out here for real, and will kill you just because you black. I got you. I and, totally and, 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 and and but we still walking around, still gang banging, shooting each other, just killing each other on the quarantine. Yeah, but yeah. but but ain't paying attention to television that we being wiped out in three different kind of ways: police, civilian white boys, and and and, and the gangs. Yeah, we the, being add the wiped. coronavirus to it because that's impacting us more than it's impacting any other race. Okay, so four four different yeah, we ways. Are, we, as a black man, boy, we up under it for real. But that's our black. fault. That's our fault because. Niggas need to stand, we need to stand up and pay attention to what the fuck is really going on. We need to start looking. Man, let's stop killing each other for one. The, 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 gang. This, the gang shit. Ain't nobody getting it. If you get a check for being from 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 a from a blood gang or a crib gang or whatever, let me know. Because I'm going to pay you too. <laughs> I'm going to pay you. I'm going to give you a check on top of check that for being a gang. Check for that. Ain't nobody getting a check for being a gang. Yeah, ain't no ain't nobody that. getting a check for how much more time you get than the next mother. Nah, yeah, and we, 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 we killing each other, and then we can sit here and watch how these people are taking us out. Man, I'm going to say and, something. And, and like when, they, when they're doing it, it's not, it's not even hitting no more like it used to be. It's just playing out, so what? That's how they're doing it, so what? When was it hitting? <laughs> before, you know, before they got before video they cameras got on their shirts? Media, before they got all that. Now it's just we doing it. And it's starting to happen just, you know, randomly. You know, every time you turn on the news, this young lady got killed in her apartment or this dude was walking home from school with his basketball. I was just like, God damn. And you know what? Through the technology now, they said, I remember when I was on the yard and uh, I can say this, you know, many years ago, we first got the phones, you know what I'm saying, using the phones while we were in the cell. Yeah. It was like, man, this motherfucker is a blessing and a curse. That's the same thing that we were saying that about technology. Right. This mm-hmm. motherfucker. You start realizing, damn, shit ain't really, you know, in your head, you think one thing. Phone going to get you caught up. Right, but if you, when you call to check in, tap in with mom, tap in with pop, tap in with you know, wife or whatever, nephews, sons, kids, you start really hearing their voice on, on some different level. Like, damn, this shit is real out there. This, You know, you start, you're like, damn, I had one thing in my head, and then when I talk to somebody or I see it on the phone, and like, damn, that shit is different, right? Yeah, for real. And you start really like, damn, man. You start really having those worries and realizing I fucked up. I've been in this mother too damn long. I, I my, my my vision is fucked up. I'm distorted on how I look at you. I hope y'all understand what I'm talking about. If y'all don't, I think Junior yeah, do. Yeah, because y'all got me. But those who looking and some of the homies is on is in the state of the federal pens. Y'all know what I'm talking about. It's a trip when you look at that phone and start talking to your people and start realizing if I was out there, this shit would be, wouldn't be going down. Then your ass end up out here and then you see this shit, you be like, what the f*** going on out here? It, it kind of like institutionalized when you start thinking penal code instead of, and then don't know how to function when you get on the outs. Yeah, but it, but, but if you could, I mean, some, some, of, some, some of the brothers or uh, sisters are because 
if you look at what they condition for, and then when they come out, you take a, it's called reentry. When you leave from there and get put out here, and you realize you can't do the shit that you, you could, what will cause you to go back, or you don't have nobody supporting your your facts and what you're saying. Man, f these fools, let's run these motherfuckers. You have to learn how to readjust because just like you went to prison and right? never been there and you had to adjust to being in there, right. now you know you're getting out. You well, don't they call that out. rehabilitation? They you, no. you, you you go through some type of rehabilitation in yeah. prison? No. That's what they tell you when you See, get out? That's what they tell you, but how it really works, your rehabilitation <laughs> comes from the partner you made amends in. Look, man, when you get out, man, that's where your rehabilitation comes from. Them yeah. motherfuckers don't care. You know what they told me? When I was walking through R and D getting out, we'll leave the light on for you. Yeah, we'll see you. We'll see you in a month, six months. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You know, they tell everybody that because they know ninety percent of them is coming back. Right. Yeah, your, ass, hold up. your ass go fucked up. You gonna be back? With, yeah. Uh, I, excuse me. One second, I'm gonna say this still. One second. I had a, 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 a for California. I had a, a CC two. I was in Calipatra, and uh, I ain't gonna say the year, but anyway, I was in the nineties. I was in Calipatra, and I went to classification. And uh, I was a sister, you know what I'm saying? Me and Patrick on, uh, I think, on the B yard. So I went in classification just for our parole. You know what she told me? She said, she just looked at me. Nice looking sister. Thick as a hundred dollar pork chop. She was sitting in there. She was looking at one of these white people. And I'm not just targeting white people. Those who were sitting in that committee. And she looked at me. She said, how long? How long is it going to take? Yeah. I was like, you, what, 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 what you talking about? Before you come she said, your ass get out in about three weeks. How long is it going to take for you to get back? In my mind, I was like, "Fuck you, ho." Yeah, I, 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 yeah, I said that. In my mind, and I said that. What you talking but about? But I think everybody that, that I did walked come out of back prison, though. yeah, I did come yeah. back, and that's why they said that each and that everybody. I did show back up. But, about this but you know what, though, James, you made a pivotal point, man. That we need to be, we need to have our right to bear arms together, yeah, and we need to really protect that right because I'm gonna tell you, in California, what they did, just like you got those white folks in the Michigan and Kentucky that's walking up to the mayor's office with guns and stuff like that. The they militias. can do that yeah, they can do that out there because they haven't gave their right to bear arms. We have slowly let these Democrats out here in California take away all our rights and soften everything up. You know why they did that? Back in the sixties and seventies when the Black Panthers was roaming, that's what they used to do. They used to walk up yeah. walk up to, to office to City Hall like with that. things like that. If you had Back in the day when the Black Panthers was jumping off, stuff like this didn't happen. You know why? Because you know what they would have did to them white boys? They would have been out there. They would have showed up 20 deep to their crib with their guns out. Citizens arrested them motherfuckers and took them down to the police precinct and said, here, y'all go do something about these. These motherfuckers killed somebody. If y'all don't do nothing about it, we are. We don't have nothing like that. Instead, what we got, we got a bunch of motherfuckers, like James said, running around killing each other. We run around shooting at each other, but our only weapon against them white folks we got <clears throat> is this motherfucker right here, this phone. <laughs> this is our weapon right here now, phone. The power. The uh, power. Hold on, James, let me say something. I'm going to tell you this. What happened, I don't give a fuck if it's a policeman or another man jumping on me. If I'm somewhere and I'm getting my ass whooped and I see y'all motherfuckers pull this motherfucker out, if I survive, we going to have some problems. Because if somebody is jumping on my brother right here, I don't give a fuck. If, it, if all my sons, I don't give a f policeman, civilian, whoever, I'm not going to sit there and let you just kill my people. You can't do that, man. We'll both be dead together, if anything, but if anything, I'm activating. And that's what hasn't happened, man. It's time to cut this shit out. It's enough of the marching. It's enough of the praying. It's enough of going to church. We need to start doing something about this shit, man. It's enough of turning the other cheek. Yeah, because, you know, as our, as our people, as our black people, I, you know, I don't know what city who was looking in. In some cities, they don't even have a black grocery store. We can't come down. We got. We can't go to. We can't come down to have our own bank. We can't come together to get our own grocery store. We can't come together to get our own car dealership. We can't get our own have our own oh, commercial property. We can. Property. We can. We, we need to do so. We have instead that. of talking about it. Well, can get with it. It's two different things. We need. To, we, if we can't get that there. We sure ain't gonna better get together and have no that, business. That's the point business that business. I'm, I've, I've been trying to make. That that at some point, we have to. We have to get better with ourselves. Correct. I you know what I'm saying? Mentioned. And I'm talking about not separate. We need to, we Unify. need to, yeah, each other. We got to, we got to do it. If we don't, if we stay Nobody the way is, we is, we do, we for the non-existent. It's, completely. Yeah, it's pretty much done. Okay, Wipe ourselves out. Let me ask you this. 
you're saying that, but to the people that don't know how or don't understand, how would you go about it? It's easy to say it, but how? It's easy, man. All, every everybody in the neighborhood got to got to got to stop. Look at this shit that we looking at, and then pay attention. We've been killing each other for many many years. Now you got these or different organizations coming up and saying it's time to stop. You got Crips, you got Bloods, uh, squashing beefs and all this other. Shit. That's it. That's the start. You got old men that walk with Martin Luther King is 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 pissed off today. You need to get them brothers out the mother closet and they need to come and organize some. Shit. You need some motherfuckers that been there in the game to we to need the Black Panther Party back. And I'm gonna tell you not, a, they, not you only know. that, not only that. You man, I'm. You have to have a structure mm -hmm. if you want to if you want to complete anything. Do Definitely any don't. other thing. You gotta have. You need order. Sure. If you don't have order, you have misunderstanding. If you don't understand, that's just why you got this COVID-19 going on and you got cats out here on the block shooting at each other still. Come on, man. This ain't the time to be killing the mother. We already dying. Mm. But we out here shooting motherfuckers because motherfuckers don't want to stay in the house. This is how fucked up it is. And who laughing? The police is sitting back smiling. Look at these ignorant motherfuckers. And we we you, just just an ignorant ass race. You said structure, yeah, and order. That's one thing that our people is not accustomed to. We because don't like we got to orders. We have to create force. But nobody likes taking orders in our in our culture. Nobody well, wants to take. Man, orders. Let me tell you, we take orders every goddamn time we go to jail. Every time other, we go in the store, from each other. They yeah, know we don't want to do and, that. And that's their goddamn problem. That's Some niggas need to die. <laughs> Some of the, the mother. That don't want to be on this mother boat, kill them. It's not funny you say that. Wait a minute, no, it's the truth. Right. If you if you don't kill the goddamn monkeys, and 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 you let them eat all the bananas, we gonna starve. I'm gonna tell you, man, we better get unstuck off stupid real quick. Thank you. Because I'm gonna tell you, we won't mess around. It won't. I'm gonna tell you, if it keep going at the rate of it is now, man. A hundred years from now, we would not be around. And I'm not it talking about I'm not talking about the mixed people and stuff like that. I'm talking about us, pure. You know what I mean? We won't be around no more. Uh -huh. Because I'm gonna tell you, man, what's happening to us, man? Right now, they have us programmed. I'm gonna tell you something that tripped me out, man. This is my boy Top Dog said this week in the studio. Dude, dog from TD, he told me this one night. He said, man, it trips him the fuck out that a will walk through the neighborhood and gun all kind of down, right? But the moment the police come in the room, he put his gun on the floor, and get on his knees, and, and submit. I said that 40 years ago. <laughs> you, you had, you no, had wait, wait, let me let me, let me, let me tell you why I did that. They were scared of that. The reason why I, I, I said that, because back in the days, when when the drive-bys was, was only Poppin cracking. Uh, BG era. Everybody, these cats do their drive-by and take off. Mm -hmm. But it's five motherfuckers in the, in the car doing the drive-by. I don't know why. But it's five <laughs> motherfuckers in the car and everybody got a gun. Yeah. But when the police get behind your ass, mm. the majority of the cats that's doing life in prison has got are are doing time because they pulled over, mm -hmm. not bailed out the car and well, yeah, and shot dope. back and got away. Yeah, yeah. If, they, if if you shoot back at the police, they gonna duck. Uh, well, they yeah. human. They human. Yeah. But you surrender. Mm. Why surrender? Street. And this is no, hold on, it's let me, like, give, let me real, get my disclaimer. It's, it's when it's real, it's real. This is our disclaimer. We're not telling y'all to go out there and fight the police. We're not telling y'all to go out there and do nothing ignorant. But what we are saying is that we better get organized. We better do something quick. He said cut down the unnecessary bullshit y'all got going on. Now, we really got to understand cut, that, cut it down. that that people, these people have an agenda. And they don't like black people. Mm. You know what I'm saying? They don't like Mexicans. Mm. And and if the Mexicans don't see it, if the black people don't see it, the white some white people and all white people ain't bad. Mm. Because mm -hmm. you got white mm. women living with black men, white mm. women living with mm -hmm. black women. There's a mix. I, I got a mixed son. My mm. son is, is white. Got mm. a little white in him. Mm. But I mean, all white people ain't bad. But the ones that's are in position, they have control, and that's the dangerous part. 
long as we keep playing like we can't see, we can't hear, mm. and we don't know how the mother talk, we ain't number monkeys. Mm. And we subject to fall off this mother planet at any time. At they distression, not mine. Mm. And then they got us to help them indirectly kill each other. Well, can I, can I say this? I hear this a lot. You know, uh, we kill more of this, da da da. These are stats. And then you hear about the same stats about COVID 19. Some people dying of regular stuff and then they entitle them that they got they died by COVID 19. Some died of a heart attack and they say COVID 19. They died by COVID 19. No, 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 no. I, I'm telling you something that I know that one of the young homies passed, God bless his soul, and, and, and recently in the city I'm from, they passed for something else and they hit him with that jacket. So I'm not saying a conspiracy theory. I think they did that with a lot of people. Okay, that so passed. But I'm, I'm, I'm trying to make a point, and the point is be that y'all people people say, well, blacks killing blacks. Look, 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 look. Whites kill whites. Mexicans, Mexicans. And also, we're not the only one doing this. No, but it's we're nothing doing like this. How you it's the real disproportionate. How you know? How you know? How you know? How you know? You want me to tell you? How I know. No, it, that shit is plain and simple. Living in the hood, growing up in the hood, what was the first time, and, and I ain't going to even use you, me, okay, okay. the first time shooting another mother of color, 12 years old. Now, you go from, from 12 years old to 45 years old, shoot mother How many mother you think? I don't <laughs> no, I'm just saying. No, that's shit over with. I ain't talking about dead and nothing. Don't let it. I'm, said, this, hurt. this is a point. This is a point. It's millions of black men my age and started at a young age has committed serious crimes amongst each other. I'm not saying that. I'm not so saying that. So this, this, here come your statistics. So if one individual can say, and I'm not going to say me or that, or just say him, that Cameron, his cousin, know that he committed Let's say 10, 15, 187s. If he know that, that's just one individual. Mm. You times that by 20 million motherfuckers that's living the same goddamn life. You go to the cemetery and look at all the motherfuckers on, on they, on they, on they what's called them, say, born in 1980, died in 1991, mm. short-lived. Motherfuckers ain't dying of cancer at 10 years old. No. At 20 years old. Correct. We have killed a lot of our own people. I'm not we have hurt. We not, big homie. But, I'm not but, saying that. But there's you don't need other, statistics. There's different, there's there's people of different ethnicities who killed their own people as well. We just. Not on the, the level that, of us. Not at the, not at the rate that we are. How, how do you get, where do you get your statistics for Because you just, you just see it there. It's there. Like he just said, man, it, it's like the thing is this. I disagree with you. First of all, like this. I can this. disagree with you. Do you see? Yeah, I'm you can. I'm going to tell, right. tell, tell you what white folks will do. We're we not hold doing it. Hold on. I'm not saying we're not. black folks are not doing it that's gang active. I'm not saying it's not want to be. We can't be talking over each other and stuff. The thing is, bro, it's like this. White people, what they will do, they'll get drunk, fight, knock each other out. But you would never see no gun come out. You never see a pistol come out. Us, first thing we do, if I'm fighting him and he knocked me out to get the best of him, me, first thing I want to go do is get a pistol. We live on our pride with our own people. We do our own people so dirty, dog. Let me, let me, let me what you call them. White people. White people in gangs. <laughs> You don't. It's not publicized that they killed each other on the street like, like blacks do. Mm. You don't see white boys that was just in a gang shooting and and killed four mm. people in the hood. You don't mm. see that. Mm. You don't see, and there's not too many white boys in prison that killed their own people. It's some. It, you got them in there, mm. but it, it not on the level. If if you get all the gang bangers. The majority of us in, in prison is for murder. A lot of them in there for murder and d d killing. I killed the blood. I killed the crib. Mm. It's a lot of us. It, it shows statistics shows in prison in the feds and and we the ones that it shows because we get more time. We get more time than the white boys. Correct. Now the Mexicans. If anybody on our level on our page is them, mm. they. 
they funk is is pretty much the same, but they don't fuck each other off like we do. Now the Mexican gangs, they war, but not as such as 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 how we do each other. And then not only that, the police, you don't hear the police killing a white boy every week, a Mexican every week. No. We are we we like a target. And and, and you gotta understand it and you gotta pay attention. I mean, I I see the streets every day, even if I ain't in that mother. If I'm not in the hood, I see it. I remember it. I lived it. I I, I know what it smell like. Mm-hmm. And every time you see a, a, a drive by, and when that mother helicopter, he got to throw his hand out. He got to show. He, yeah, what's happening? Yeah, I'm doing this. <laughs> we put ourselves out there, correct, to be put in situations. We do this to ourselves but then when we do it to ourselves why get mad at the mother police man he just killed your cousin that's because because it's close to home mm. but these niggas over here just killed your, your nephew mm. we mad at the police for doing what we doing to ourselves see what i'm saying I got, I got so when you do this and you when you do statistics we just got to look at it from within you know a lot of cats has been killed through drive-bys and and the and the gangsters, mm-hmm. the the blood and the crib thing. Mm-hmm. Just think how many over the last fifty years, sixty mm-hmm. years. That's a whole lot of us. That's a whole lot of us. Mother, I'd have rather died in Vietnam or something than die in the mother Compton, L.A. Mm-hmm. or in a mother alley. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So it don't statistics don't mean. Shit. Because you never know how many motherfuckers on this planet or how many motherfuckers in the hood. Mm-hmm. So statistics is something some brilliant motherfucker come up with and say, I think it was like 180,000 bloods and 690 million crips. <laughs> how the fuck would you know that? Yeah, you you count that it. Math. You can't count that. But at the same time, like I said. Just this? like the corona. Shit. You can't count that. Can I say One this? One thing. I know we, we run out of time. Can okay. I say this right quick before we go big on me and mm-hmm. uh, Mr. Steele? Mm-hmm. Yeah, white boy go in and shoot up 13, 14 motherfuckers. Shoot up innocent folks. Yeah, you see that, and that's you. Know I mean, they, 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 do, they do one crime, never got no record or nothing to go in there and start out 16, 40, 50 motherfuckers. That's because they listen to rap music. Oh! <laughs> that was a joke. <laughs> okay. All uh, right, we in it on that, dude. what you're saying, man, but. Um, we in it. You know, this one of those episodes, man, that we not going to come up with no solution to this, this one episode, man. It's just healthy dialogue, food for thought. man. Food for thought. Mm-hmm. But I will tell y'all this out there. It's a lot of stuff going on. We really living in some turbulent times right for now. For sure, we are. No doubt. Whatever you got going on. Biblical this, times. Stack your money up. We are truly living in some crazy times right now. Just on another note, um, Tyson Foods, that's the second biggest food manufacturer in the world, said that our food supply chain is broken, which means that we might start running out of food at any time oh. in the next, like, in the next month. Like, seriously. And that's because we got rid of the farmer. Just, we living in some crazy times in America right now. Hey, we run out of food. I'm going to be a... <laughs> we'll see y'all next week. <laughs> Unedited content, live streams with some of Digital Soapbox's most polarizing hosts like James McDonald and others. Sign up for your Digital Soapbox membership today. Packages start from $1.99 to $4.99 monthly, where you not only get exclusive content, but you also get it commercial free. Press that button now.